All right, uh, it's time for our first major conversation right here on The Breakfast on Plus TV Africa. The Independent National Electoral Commission, Nigeria's Electoral Empire, uh, has uh, set aside over three billion naira as budget to defend the results of the February 25 presidential and national assembly election and the March 18 governorship and state assembly polls. Now, so far, uh, over 100 election petitions have been filed by aggrieved uh, candidates and their parties across the country. Uh, the presidential candidates of the People's Democratic Party, Atiko Abubakar, a Labour Party, Peter Obi, the Action Alliance, the Solomon Okangbao, Okangwan, rather, her allied people's movement, Chichi OJ, have also filed petitions for the nullification of the presidential election results. INEC had on March 1 declared the All Progressives Congress presidential candidate, as we all know, um, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, as the winner of the February 25 uh, presidential election. But the five candidates filed petitions seeking the nullification of the poll. Also, uh, election petition tribunals in over 12 states have equally received petitions from uh, National Assembly candidates who are not satisfied with the results of the just-concluded elections. The states where the petitions had been received uh, include Edo, Plateau, uh, a Plateau State, uh, Ondo State, Kwara State, Ogun State, Bayelsa State, Oyo, Oshun, Ekiti, Bochi, uh, Lagos, and Niger States. And I'm glad to say that we have uh, joining us this morning to discuss this uh, situation, Shola Omolaya, who is a public affairs analyst. He joins us via phone from AKT State. Shola, good morning to you. It's great to have you again. Good morning and good morning. All right. Um, three billion naira, that's a lot of money. Though, I mean, if you look at uh, the over 300 billion naira INEC uh, had on its budget, it uh, is a drop in the ocean. Um, that's about 1%, but it's still a sizable amount of money. Uh, should I, if three billion dropped into my account uh, or your account, we know what we will do, <laughs> how we we'll react. So that's a lot of money. Um, uh, is this is this money well spent for INEC to, uh, you know, face all these barrage of cases? We're talking about over hundred uh, post-election cases, but before the elections, we had over six hundred pre-election cases, post-party primary uh, cases at the courts. Um, INEC seems to be overwhelmed. Would you would you say that? Well, I, I, I think this um, this money, like uh, the Nigerian man would say, this money they are trying to spend does not call for at all. Do you know what it costs Nigerians to um, come with this election? The chairman of INEC gave us a state of the world election that will be coming up. Meaning that at the end of the election in total, Nigeria will have a very peaceful draft that we don't need to risk money. Why it's like by like increasing the budget of after election period. Now look at what we experienced in the last election. Same amount of money was spent. They told us all kinds of stories. Petition issue to court. I believe that what happened in our state states has been a great lesson and lessen the cost of expenditure that will be embarking on, on legal matter. Excuse me. Don't we have legal investment among the INEC who are being paid monthly? For what? They have budget for some stationaries that includes whatever they might want to defend within the judicial premises or outside. We are not there yet. We are talking of three billion naira that could construct a very good end, uh, a general hospital in, 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 in units or zones if you want to split it. Give one to Abuja. And give three three to each of uh, this all or two two. So it just shows you that some of our leaders are not right thinking. I come to think of it. You hear this today, they will tell you that that information is not coming from their head. 
have been misquoted yet? What are they saying? What is the purpose of Jesus? Is to reduce all kinds of illegality that must come up after the election. Who is pulling who? Is the legal exp expenses going to be much more than uh, 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 the proper election? Excuse me, this money does not come from. It's wrong. Because if Diva has done this much, do you know one thing, sir? The total vote count is as far lesser than what we used to have in the past. What is the total vote count of major state? What are they depending in for? How much are they spending? Okay, it then means that he already knows that there's going to be a, 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 a breakdown of some of the policies they have put in place before the election? Why? I don't think this, this I next need to be questioned on so many things on how to spend money. Why three billion? How many states? They are mentioning just to say, let Kukuma add those two because you see that one uh, legislative uh, member is going to put either in the state of House of Assembly or they are all involved. You can't believe anything that you will find one person writing a petition to Fox. And they will still go as far as to do Fox. Why that? I think they need to check the electoral law the more. Because we don't know how this will take place. When they will be, most of them, most of the, uh, the, uh, the president, the office of the president, you know, be sworn in the next couple of days, May 29, and all the legislation will be sworn in by, by June. And we are still here, dangling on the amount of money we are going to spend on such an issue. Where? How? You have primary issue from each of the parties, and the electoral law has forced a guy before the general election. We the citizen, we also have a problem. We are not checking so many things. We are just shouting and making noises uh, that I think they, uh, we don't need to participate in. These are the areas that politicians take advantage of because they know. Uh, 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 the IMF officials, they, they didn't check into the uh, areas that could hold the political institution at the, at the Jupiter. No, they just allow a free right for everybody. Even the free power, there are no free things. We have to, we need to go in, not discussing political individual anymore. Let us begin to go through all our little law. I wish the likes of the uh, 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 giving is around. Because when the Guinea was around, I think it, it was almost uh, picked as the spokesperson of IMEC. I know because it was his, and he has always been an activist. So it, it gave him room to come on air to educate people and to take notes. But on this ground, we don't know who, to, who you can talk to unless the, uh, the chairman of IMEC is there. Honestly, this money does not come. Well, um, uh Omolayo, I mean, uh, some persons, or uh, you have a group of persons who are who share a different opinion from what you're saying, and 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 those persons actually think that 300 billion naira is not enough. Uh, if you look at you know the uh, concerns, over 100 cases has been filed by political. Hello. Can you? Hello, please can you come Can you hear me now? Yes, I can hear you. So I'm, I'm saying that, uh, on the other hand, you have a lot of persons who would not agree with your position this morning as to uh, querying why three billion naira should be spent. And so this person is saying, if you, if you look at you know, the, uh, the number of cases that has been filed, over 100 cases by uh, candidates as well as their political parties across the entire country, three billion naira is not enough. That's on the one hand. But also, I'd like to ask you, what do you make of our democracy when you have, you know, the courts being uh, at the forefront of it, very dominant? I just told you now that for me, uh, when it comes to issues like that, we have four things. For those who will be honest, I have not been decided either, neither Am I for death? Or I'm not with death? But what I'm saying is why must you spend 
or assume that you'll be spending over three billion naira after an election. What was the cost of the election itself? All right. And now actually, the legal department of INEC has always been there. What is only what what is their budget every year for cases like this? Or why do they have the legal department? Somebody must be willing to educate me or educate us. Are they on contract? If they are on contract, okay. It means that whenever you call them on board, they will give you their budget. And if they are not on contract, on what basis are they being paid? What? You talk of legal issue that is it costing transport? I think are they, are they discussing the, the transport costs are the waiting. The question is, my sister, if you want to go to, can you take time as a big journalist and investigate how much did this uh, one be that? And let's call one INEC official who is in the purchasing department, so to say, and ask them from the elementary man, sir, how much do you get your own feedback? Now or before. Some of these things must be put on the table. If they come to your management and they want to tax you, they will tax you based on your environment and based on, based on your workforce. When it comes to the issue of government or agent of government, who we'll check all of these things out. So if anybody wants to contact you, they can go ahead. And because language they will say naira is dollar is and all sorts of but let them put this on paper and let's ask let them ask us how what why do you need this fund last time it was about two point something billion now it is three billion why then what is the main purpose of development when you introduce EBA? is it not to, to reduce the crime in electoral acts, are we increasing? Is it that the crime is increasing, or the numbers of voters have increased, which is very, very wrong, not true? All the total voters in general in this election of either the 20th, the one of 25th of February, or the 18th of March, my sister, go check notes. And compare it to the election, the total broadcast of election of 2019. People call it uh, there is an apathy. But you told me here, I will agree to the fact that February 26th, people came on out. All out, that's what we're saying. Which is not true. But we keep that for another day. At your last election, who is seen to be free and fair? We had oh, almost 30 million votes. Option A, four. And if you are saying this is the best, then we should have almost double the number of the total vote cast. Because these are the things you want to, you want to have the very court. I'm not a lawyer, but I think I have an energy sense. You should come to listen. Put all these notes together and ask INEC officials. Or the Algata Secretary, the chairman. That's it. Why are you spending this much? Is it just this the passing petition? We are talking of how many political parties that are going to court, writing petition. How about, how about, how about now? How about? I like, I like for you to say, uh, 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 overtake is overtaking, overtake. That's the way we find ourselves. Okay. Yeah. All right. Um, uh, it is very interesting uh, what you've said, um, but we, we can look at the fact that, um, yes, you talked about the legal department of INEC. Uh, they had some reorganization in a couple of years ago, and they, they have a legal department which is uh, now standalone. Um, uh, if you do the mathematics, 
uh, if we, did, we say they have more than 100 um, uh, cases right now, post-election cases to, to uh, attend to, then we're looking at uh, uh, over 100 of them, the 3 billion naira. You want to divide it by, let's just say, 110 cases. It will amount to 27 million, uh, 272,727 naira, 27 kobo per, per case. So we just approximated 27.2 million naira. Uh, when we look at the average cost of hiring a lawyer um, in, in Nigeria, um, sir, I mean, we lawyers get paid per hour. Um, uh, is, is this really too much? Because you're looking at how many hours are spent at the, uh, the initial tribunal, from there they go to the Court of Appeal, from there they go to the Supreme Court. So those are, those are three stages. And this is just a budget. INEC may or may not spend the money. So, um, I mean, 100 cases and more are coming. More are coming. You know, you have to go three levels. Um, and these lawyers have to work. They have how many days with which to um, dispense of these cases. Is, it, is this really too much? Is this really too much? Some lawyers charge per hour in this country, and lawyers are not cheap. And then they double their prices when it comes to... Uh, Political cases, just like uh, the media, we also have our surcharge when it comes to political adverts. Sir? This, this, this person is speaking with the lab. <laughs> My brother, let me, let me come look. How do you know that, God forbid, that I'm rabbi coming to your, your station of working? How do you know? Without the knowledge, of your boss. How do you know? You know if you answer it. You get a budget in preparation to a crime. What are we saying here? Hundred, who just said that more will be coming? Was it an orchestrated plan? That this is where we stand on this, this is what we are going to do next. How do you know? How are you sure that if you give this, you prepare this budget to this guy, after another three months when you have another government in power, they'll be telling you they, have, they need more money? In continuity of the, 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 the fight against an extra issue they have? How? How? We need to ask the legal department. What is your job? Are they on contract? How do they come about this? But, but, this but, but, yeah, but, 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 Mr. Omolayo, if, if you're looking at the legal department of INEC, I, I don't know if they have 100 lawyers. You know, because Which, looking at, they have a legal office in each of their state uh, offices. I say, maybe we best ask now. I just ask you a question. Yes. If you don't have skeleton in your cupboard, in your cupboard, why do you choose not to come to work? On the day of robbery, in fact, you told somebody that it's going to be a robbery because of this are not coming to work. And you think you should not be arrested? How do they know that we need such an amount of money? Do they have, uh, do they have perfect fears in their, 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 their employees? Maybe some man of who works with them. That's a stop. Maybe Mr. Will you begin to open books? Maybe. How do you know that? Yeah, yes, sir. Sorry. Maybe they looked at last last election how much they spent, and then did a uh, prepare a budget based on that. Twenty nineteen. Okay, okay. It's an election. Is it not one of the three? I don't think we're studying what what is the ground rights of the will be coming in the next couple of days. When the chairman of of, of a party has been suspended, is part of the the, the instrument that they are supposed to use in court. I ask you, how do they know? That they will need that much of three billion dollars. This is my hair money for God's sake. So, so, so. This is how we'll be running this thing. So, and we should appreciate that. The lawyer will be taking the amount of money. He needs from no Mohalla. My question is how do they know? Okay. How do they uh, uh, is uh, immediate attention? I'm a liar. I'm a liar quickly. I, I see also like us to look at the fact that over time, when people uh, go out to cast their votes every other election yeah. period, we always seem to have uh, the cases in court where the court will now decide, you know, who becomes 
the president or the governor, what have you, and all of that. So again, I put to you, and I'm asking what your thoughts are, where we seem to have the judiciary or the court dominating our democracy. See, these, these are the defender of the right of the nation. I whatever um, you want to say. The law and its instrument will always be best for any institution, either either activism or all kinds of form. That's the, 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 the that organ. Now, I am also saying they also have all organizations have a discussion that treats legal matter. I am not saying for me, why am I not with that? That amount of money is that one. How do they presume to be willing to spend such an amount? That's one. Two, what is the position of the legal department? Three, the INET law has not been studied enough to break that gate of an extended error from the primary that enters into the main general election. That is, most of this area is not needed if INET has done his diligence by making sure before any of the general election, all primary issues must have been resolved. These are areas, the, 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 the INET are the professional heads who knows the letters of all the rules of every election and political party. So there are things that ought to have been done, not until when you are forming a, a candidate of a party. After the swearing in, or a few days to swearing in, you will just hear a declaration that that person has lost his position. I need to be held responsible for some of these things. One party we say that was not there when we are doing, doing our primary, another one we say I that was there. Just like what happened in our shoe, just like the Cairo. And if we go to Supreme Court, that's the laxity of the of, of I need. Why do we give you such a thing? And nobody is punished. But on the day of the election, somebody that eat it was at the police put holding his phone. We say it's causing trouble. The greatest struggle that we have, we know where it's coming from. I'm not saying that they should not spend any money or whatever. They should not take some things to court because that's not it. But the elementary part of which you be checked. You open your door, you feel right to enter your house. No locker. That's, that's the thing. All right. Uh, uh, you, you made a point, uh, you, know, you know, you were saying that... Uh, uh, trying to insinuate that this, these uh, plethora of cases must probably uh, may indicate that INEC uh, didn't perform well uh, in the elections because if they did well, probably they worked with the beavers and all that, like they said, would have had a reduction in the number of litigations. Um, but it could be argued that, you know, politicians always want to look for, uh, if they can't go in through the door, they'll go in through the window. Uh, if they can't go in through the window, they would like to go in through the, the, the roof. You know, so can we can we blame Minec for politicians and the way they act? You know, with all these cases and more to come. Uh, I think somebody, a land said, a white man that died at the at the backyard of a policeman, he get as he did. I repeat, a white man who died at the backyard. Of a foolish man, he gets as he did. See, politicians all over the world will always be who they are, and they will always act likewise. Even in in UK, in UK there are that have been in this institution for almost five hundred years, if not more than, they still have their problem. But the laws are there. To check meet them. If you have strong men who can manage laws, all of these things, some of these things we play around with, we just fade away. Look at what happened in America. Yes, I love Donald Trump like this. But the law 
will not allow him. Because there are men who have built that law in the United States of America today that you can't do otherwise. The law will push it out because the, if the law has created men, that if you are holding this up, this is what you should do. For the first time, I think we also have a man, like him or not, who are State of the uh, 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 electoral law, so that he will not be found wanting. I'm not saying that is a say to uh, because it is, it is something that is not. Uh, <laughs> let's leave that for another thing. So, whichever way you look at it, the only person you can see who is the anchor, the class monitor of this. Uh, election that we are carrying on which is on INEC. Politicians, see sir, politicians are like children. At times if you don't wink your eyes, they will turn your food around. Put your food off the table. Children in the house, if if they are playing, if you are not careful, you don't bring out the road. Oh mom, let me take your television. Play basketball. These are children. I make us to be the ref, the right referee that is not scared of coming up with his uh, yellow card or red card. Put it on his bed. That's the only way out. Because when you are saying this, you are bringing another one. You call them I make it. I make. They are independent. They tell you this. You are not contesting, you are not contesting. All right. All right. You can take on at the presidency too. <laughs> Mr. Oshola, <laughs> Omolayo, thank you, you very much. Yes, uh, interesting thoughts. Um, you know, some 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 law firms charge uh, 100 million naira, as much as 100 million naira to... Uh, uh, to uh, hundred, I can't in, yeah, I'm saying some law firms charge as much as 100 million naira for uh, mm. election-related cases, you know, where... Uh, um, I don't know how INEC will go about it, whether they would say, so, okay, law firm A, handle Lagos State. Law firm B, handle Akwaibo and all that. Um, let's see how it goes. Uh, but the thing I think we can all agree on is that this is a season of harvest uh, for the legal community in Nigeria. Lawyers will really uh, be smiling to the bank uh, at the end of all of this. <laughs> yes. yes. INEC rules in to announce that is to be spent for any election. My God, uh, Miss, hey, Miss Olam, that's Olam, how I like it. We have, have to go. We have to go. <laughs> we have to go. 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 See, I think we should go back to the electoral law. All right, sir. We have to go, Mr. Molayo. Thank you very much. Sir, thank you so much for your time. You said it all. Go back to the electoral law, he's saying, and uh, let's make sure Enoch doesn't spend these amounts of money. You know, for a country that, uh, thank you, Mr. Muller, I we have to go for a country that has a lot of debt. We are in serious debt. And one would look, think that the authorities are looking at ways to, you know, make sure they use money judiciously and save money, not waste it. Uh, anyway. uh, uh, and, and you also... Kofi, we need to just move away. Yeah, let's go, let's go for it. You, know, yeah. see, I like I what you're doing. You see, this I've been saying. Sometimes, just laugh at the way things are, are done. <laughs> you know, you, you organize an election, you spend almost more than $1 billion, and then you don't do it well. Now, what, imagine what, what that you have to, to do waste? it well so we don't have to get to the point where people are... So many court cases. Uh, people are now asking spend again. To, hey, we're not agreeing. We're not going agree. You know, so imagine that you know. we got it right. We have to get it right. So we don't have to get to the point where we have to be defending. It's been, I mean, according to that word, we say being proactive. But that hasn't been the case for us. And yeah. you can't stop the people from yeah. approaching the court mm -hmm. when they feel that the right has been, yeah, you know... Uh, overlooked or uh, you know discriminated against whatever it is however you want to put it put it at we just take a break at this point when we return we're looking at the second conversation and that'll be briefly the issue of you know deregulation fuel subsidy removal according to the uh, uh, petroleum industry act and the fact that petrol might just be selling for 750 naira per liter this is according to you know the thoughts of stakeholders please stay with us we'll be right back <laughs>